Christopher Landrum, Mastermind Bullies of the South. In Houston, Dallas, um, that's where most of our location is. We got a couple of kennel partners in Alabama. Um, we just kind of everywhere, all around the South. Um, my brother, my brother started in 2013, and you know, just being around him, seeing the dogs, fell in love with him, and I wanted to get me one, and I got me one, and I didn't look back. My goal is I. I I'm here, so of course I like to show. So I want show quality bulls. Um, you know, every bull is not show quality. You know, some bulls are, you know, breed type and you use them, you know, for that reason. I just want to create beautiful, show quality, correct bulls and healthy bulls. If I would have to say birthing, the birthing and the mothers, because, you know, it's not, it's not always up to you, you know. Mother Nature's take is some, some, you know, things happen, you miss out on litters. And it's not about the money, it's just about you put so much work in to get to that point and to that litter. And you're so excited about it and, and you know, bad things happen. But on the other side, I've had more good days than I had bad days with that. So I'm still thankful. Ch Grand Champion Zay told me. He was the first dog I got. He's a two-time world star male. Um, world star took to a Magoo daughter. Um, he's my pride and joy. Yeah, sleeps with my son every night, so, yeah. Um, accomplishment will probably be grand champion, my male out, Zaytoven. But I think just for me more so, just going to these shows, seeing these people, you know, building this relationship with these people, it, it makes it more fun. When I first got to the shows, I didn't really know people. So I wasn't really talking to people, right. but now that you know I know people, I'm excited to go to the shows. It's fun to me. I get to you know have conversations with people that love dogs, about dogs. So it's just a day dedicated to dogs. So and I love it. Oh, I see myself in the ring for sure, winning. Um, like I said, I just want to create beautiful show bulls, and you know hopefully it'll show up in the ring, and and you will see me too. <laughs> I think the biggest thing is for me is my love for animals, period. It's not, you know, not just dogs. I love animals. Um, me and my brother always, you know, had dogs, had pigs, you know, had forms coming up. So my love for animals is, a, you know, a lot different, goes a little further. But these dogs, man, they, you know, they love you regardless. And, you know, have, just having them around and having their personalities, seeing the different personalities is fun. I, I, I enjoy that more than I do anything. I got a lot of up and coming litters. Um, I got a, a champion detox daughter that I just took to, um, I took to King Louis right here. I got a, um, I just took grand champion Zaytoven to my other detox daughter. You know, I got a detox to, um, detox to Jada Kiss, which is, she's a um, chomper daughter. Yeah, she's a chomper daughter. So I got that litter dropping on the fifth. What else do we have dropping? Um, I got two times Rocco. I'm Chocolate Grim to a detox daughter. Um, Grand Champions Otoven just dropped a litter two, two to three days ago off of a, um, one of my other kennel partners. So definitely a team, definitely a team. Um, we all, we work together. If, if I can't do something and somebody else need it, we always there, you know, even if it's, you know, rough for us to get done. We helping each other out continuously and we just trying to build and grow. Yeah. Um, mastermind bullies, man, just stay on the lookout for us. You know, we're doing more than dogs. So we, we're building relationships, we're building communities, we're building businesses. So it's, it's more than about dogs, it's about, you know, uh, uh, communication and a relationship that we all build together and we going out and we touching other people. Can people find you? Where's, what's your social media and stuff like that? Um, Chris.Landrum46 on Instagram and Chris Landrum on Facebook.